Hello everyone, good morning to all. This is Dr. Krishna Ray from Department of Agriculture, MMDU, Mulana. I am going to discuss about mushroom production and productivity scenario throughout the world and as well as in India. Well, mushroom is a fungus. It has fleshy fruiting body uh, and the fruiting body are consisted with these fine thread like structures known as mycelia. And the body part can be divided into two halves. First one is cap like structure that is known as pileus and it is attached with this base known as stalk. And the mycelia helps the mushrooms to absorb the nutrients from the soil. And totally these are achlorophyllous and saprophytic and that is why they do not require sunlight for their growth. So, these are the cultivated mushroom species throughout the world. The mostly cultivated species here you can see are auricularia species, flamulina species, pleurotus species, agarica species, volvariella species and lentinula species. So, let us see the world wide mushroom cultivation pr production status. Commercial production of mushroom has started after second world war and this is the picture illustrating you the top 10 countries which are producing mushrooms at uh, enormous amount. Among the mushroom producing countries, China is the leading producer followed by Italy, United States of America, Netherlands, Poland, Spain. France, Canada, United Kingdom and Iran. Now let us see the total uh, sorry contribution of the mushroom producing countries to the global production of mushroom. In the year 2020, China has ranked first among these countries producing an estimated 40 million metric tons of mushrooms, whereas in India the uh, con contribution of India is only uh, 0.21 million metric tons to the total global production of mushroom. These three species of mushrooms are widely cultivated in India. These are white button mushrooms that is Agaricus bisporus, western mushrooms or dhingri mushroom that scientific name of this is uh, Pleurotus sazurkaju and white milky mushrooms that is Callosaeve indica. Now let us see the uh, production status and productivity status of mushrooms in India. Mushroom industry in India is mainly focused on white button mushroom productions and it has, uh, uh, there are uh, two different types of mushroom growers in the uh, India. Who, who, uh, some of the farmers are growing mushrooms uh, in India throughout the year. They are the round the year cultiv uh, cultivator of mushrooms and some groups of farmers are cultivating mushrooms seasonally. And uh, seasonal growers are uh, uh, found only in, uh, in the uh, northern part of India and western part of India. And uh, if you will see the uh, data of mushroom production and productivity of India, you can see that uh, the variation of data uh, from 1970 to, 19, to 2019 and per, uh, increasing rate of mushroom production is 4.3 percent and during this period the productivity has raised from 20 percent to 24.5 percent by releasing of um, improved strains of commercial edible mushrooms. Now let us see the resources to be needed for mushroom farming. So, uh, for, uh, the main important factors for mushroom cultivations are diverse climatic conditions, then uh, uh, manpower and crop residues and market. After, obviously, after cultivation of mushrooms, marketing is necessary to get good remuneration. So, in India, these four factors are uh, very much uh, available for cultivating mushrooms. India has diverse climatic conditions and dive, uh, all the type of edible and medicinal mushrooms can be cultivated throughout the India. Now uh, for 
cultivation of mushrooms, good combination of both the technical and non-technical manpower is needed to operate mushroom growing activities because mushroom uh, cultivation task is not a single-handed task. It requires uh, skilled manpower, uh, professional mycologist or uh, experienced uh, skilled personnel for uh, spawn production and compost preparation. And uh, the uh, for marketing purpose also the good uh, marketing channel should be there. So if is, uh, there, uh, is there any shortage for uh, manpower in India, the answer will be no. Now in India, there are sufficient amount of uh, crop residues. As the cro uh, rice wheat cropping system is following in India throughout the uh, uh, in, uh, India and uh, it should uh, there are uh, the management of these types uh, these crop residues are a tough challenge to the farmers. So so uh, these types uh, of crop residues can be utilized for uh, preparation of compost to the uh, for the mushroom cultivation. Now, uh, the fourth uh, uh, factor for mushroom cultivation and getting good remuneration is the market. So, uh, as India is uh, the second most population, populous country with more than 1.3 billion population, so India can be itself a large market for consumption of mushroom. So, now let us see the contribution, species wise contribution of different mushrooms in the India. So, before uh, up to 2010, the contribution of white button mushroom was more, it uh, the share of uh, white button mushroom to the country's total production was 89 percent, whereas the production of western mushroom was only 6 percent. But uh, the recent data revealed that the contribution of white button mushroom is uh, going to be decreased as the western mushroom production is increasing in different parts of India especially in the western and uh, sorry eastern part of india western but western mushroom is cultivating uh, at uh, uh, much amount now here is i am representing the st state wise uh, mushroom production scenario in the uh, in india so uh, initially uh, up to 2010 or 2000 uh, uh, 12, the uh, Punjab, Haryana and uh, uh, Maharashtra was the leading uh, producer of mushroom. But nowadays, uh, the data has revealed that the uh, eastern part of India like uh, Urissa uh, and uh, uh, in the western part, the uh, Maharashtra is the emerging states for cultivating mushrooms. And uh, Haryana is the top uh, uh, most produ producer of uh, mushrooms. And in this uh, southern part, Tamil Nadu is the top producer of mushroom. Now let's see the nutritional benefits of the mushrooms. So there are uh, there are immense uh, nutritional value of mushroom. Edible mushrooms have been consumed by humans, but not only as part of normal diet, but also to maintain health and increase longevity. Mushroom is an excellent source of dietary components such as protein fibers, vitamins, minerals, folic acids, carbohydrates and it has low amount of fat. Important bioactive compounds of mushroom are antioxidants like beta-glucans, terpenes and polysaccharides. Now let us see the health benefits of mushrooms. For centuries, scientists have understood that mushrooms have both preventive and therapeutic effects and are an essential part of good health. This view is now being increasingly adopted around the world. In addition, mushroom extracts have been found to have profound health promoting benefits. Nowadays, mushroom cultivation is gaining importance because of their role as immunity booster to treat detrimental diseases. The mushroom active substances of uh, have roles to reduce the diseases like Alzheimer, reducing uh, blood sugar, then reducing the uh, spreading and form generation of uh, cancer cells and to reduce the uh, rickettsia and asthma like disease, de uh, deadly diseases. Now let us see the opportunities of mushroom farming in India. So, 
uh, there are diff, uh, so many opportunities for India as you have seen that there are so many scopes for cultivating mushrooms in India. And the, uh, the first opportunities is the big gap between the demand and supply in the world trade and the shrinkage of production in western countries due to high labor costs would result in better market price for Indian mushroom producers. Second one is, in the one hand, it will provide the opportunities for small and uh, marginal farmers to cultivate the mushrooms at indoor practice because mushroom can be cultivated on the wasteland also. And on the other hand, development of infrastructural facilities and well uh, organized distribution of network will provide greater opportunity for marketing of fresh mushroom to meet the domestic consumers uh, demands. Now third one is from the uh, after harvesting of the mushroom, the spent compost of the mushroom can be utilized for uh, production of uh, or preparation of organic manure, then vermicompost, etc. at the commercial scale. Now fourth one is the uh, India, uh, the geographical location of India make its potential to produce uh, the mushrooms at optimized level and to export the mushrooms to the Middle East and Southeast Asia and the European countries. So this is all about the uh, today's lecture uh, uh, about mushroom production and productivity and scope and opportunity of mushroom farming in India. Thank you very much.